Hello and welcome back. Time has come for another update of EDAP tools and in this short video I will present to you some of the more important new features in version 6.9. The most exciting of them all must be the new high-performing fast Kineflex in Animate. Our users must be aware that uh, with the introduction of the so-called advanced layers, Adobe crippled Kineflex's performance in Animate 2019. And since then, there has been a disparity between how Kineflex performed in Flash and Animate, at least on Windows. So now this uh, issue has been resolved and we will be enjoying Kineflex as smooth as it is in Flash in all versions of Animate. For the purpose of stress testing, we designed this 35 element smart magnet rig and you can see how well it performs and how smoothly the screen refreshes. This is the master parent here that I'm uh, transforming and it is extremely responsive as you can see with all the eight legs and eight effectors. I have to mention that there is a new setting in Kineflex. This is quick settings and it's called rig complexity. It's only available in animate because in flash it is unnecessary. You can choose the level of rig complexity, which is a relative value depending on your hardware capabilities. So for an older computer, the same rig will be perceived as a more complex, while a new powerful workstation will have no difficulty transforming it. So this is a, an eight year old machine, so definitely not very fast by contemporary standards and for it I chose a setting of high for this rig. You can also access uh, of course the settings from the control panel Kineflex and there is some explanation here what the setting means. If we go to medium we will probably see some stutter but with a lighter rig medium or uh, even uh, low would be just fine. If we take this rabbit as an example, a setting of low will be uh, perfectly fine for it and will produce a very smooth results. While with a complex rig like this one, a setting of low will give us some stutter. So switching the setting for rig complexity to match your rig will produce the best possible results and it will be up to the user to experiment which uh, is the best setting for your specific hardware and the specific design that you're working with. Another addition to our feature set is the ability of smart graphic control now to filter content based on three criteria all frames keyframes and labels now up until now we could uh, of course always uh, hide thumbnails that we didn't want to see by shift clicking on them but now we can use labels inside and just filter out the content based on labels so if you remember the way I set up this skirt was that uh, every other frame shows the front element while the back elements go in sync on the even numbers. Let's, uh, let's look at the all frames again. So one and two, for example, one and two go in sync. So one is the front part and two is the back part of the skirt and the two are uh, hard welded so they, they work in sync and the legs are sandwiched in between these two elements okay 
let's look inside the skirt I've added labels on every other frame which allows us to filter those frames and only display the frames that we want to see because the back part of the skirt is a synced element and it is controlled by the panel we don't want to see them we don't uh, want to click on them so this is how syncing and filtering works with the new smart graphic control panel and the third feature which i'd like to highlight is a little addition to find and replace strokes up until now we could change the color and the thickness and the alpha of the strokes but we could not uh, fully delete strokes now this is an option it's a small addition but extremely useful and it could not be done in flash or animate before so of course depending on your selection criteria you can delete strokes entirely by inputting minus one here in this uh, thickness field now we'll choose to remove all black strokes with a setting of minus one in the whole document we'll just replace them with nothing there you go in all symbols all black strokes were removed uh, these eyes here uh, use fills so it's it's not a stroke and the red strokes here were preserved but of course uh, and the most important and most exciting in this update will be the new powerful high performing kineflex so everyone enjoy edap tools version 6.9